In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to create a Microsoft Vista-inspired menu in Photoshop. First of all, load an image of your background in Photoshop. Now select the rectangular tool and draw it on the canvas. Adjust its size and place it at the bottom of the image. Change its name to Lower Part, open up its blending options, move over to the Gradient Overlay tab, and choose 000000 for the left side and 0C0C0C C for the right side. Once this is done, duplicate the layer, move it on top, change its name to upper part, and open up its blending options. Move over to the Gradient Overlay tab and choose 35393D for the left side and 787B7D for the right side. Click on the Stroke tab, set its size to two points, and click on the OK button to apply it. Now click on the background layer, select the rectangular tool, draw it on the canvas, press the control key, and click on the shape layer to load its selection. Now delete the shape layer and press control J on the keyboard to duplicate the selection and change its name to menu. Apply the Gaussian blur filter on this layer using the five pixels for the radius. Next, open its blending options, move over to the Gradient Overlay tab, set its opacity to 50%, choose the white to transparent gradient, set the angle to negative 90 degrees, and scale to 150%. Now move over to the Stroke tab, set its size to 1 point, opacity to 30%, color to FFFFF, and click on the OK button to apply it. Now all you need to do is insert the text for your menu, and you're done. 